Hello my friends, welcome to Bunny Tales. Today we're going to make a fun activity for your little ones who are learning how to count. We're going to start by getting a piece of cardboard or a little cardboard box. Then we're going to draw a bunny on the front of the cardboard. You can draw any animal you want to and change out what you're going to feed it. This activity is great for teaching children how to count and work on number object correlation. It's very important to use a variety of different activities and switch them out when working on numeracy and teaching children how to count because you want them to learn that numbers are part of everyday life and we use them in different settings and we use them at different times. After coloring in the rabbit, I'm going to mark the areas that I'm going to cut out. So I'm going to cut out the mouth and a little circle in the stomach. That way the child can see the carrots that they are feeding the bunny. After I am done cutting out the mouth and the tummy circle, I am going to get a clear bag. I'm using a Ziploc bag here, but you can use any clear bag you want to as long as you can tape it to the back of the bunny and have the food come into the mouth and it will show in the stomach. Um, make sure that the bag is open on the top so that you can take out the carrots and then reuse them over and over. After I'm done cutting it out and gluing the bag inside, I can get started on making the carrots. I'm going to make the carrots by cutting out some felt into carrot shapes. And then I'm going to use some pipe cleaner and a glue gun to make the tops of the carrots. You could do this or you could draw some carrots on some cardboard, color it, and cut them out. Now that we have all the pieces ready, we are ready to have fun. You can have your little one roll some dice. Over here I have a big foam dice which is very easy for children to use. They roll the dice, they get a number. Then they practice number correlation and counting as they feed the bunny that number of carrots. You can play this over and over and practice different numbers. I hope your little one enjoys this activity. Please subscribe to the channel and don't forget to hit the like button so I can make more fun videos. Thank you!